Okay, Ryan Steinelson here with Accelerate Marketing, and I am really excited to have Jacob, the immigration attorney, Sapochnik, on the call with me today. He is from San Diego. I'm so jealous he's in San Diego right now because there's waves every day there. Outside of that, what are we talking about today, Jacob? We talk about LSAs and um, you know the different ways you can use it to uh, amplify your business, right? Yes, but more, more specifically, we're talking about the three R's that we talked about the last time, which was right. previous, yeah. reviews, and response time. And actually, I'm going to add another R in there, which is rate. Basically, how much are you willing to bid for a qualified lead? How much are you willing to pay? Google right. is going gonna, is gonna to rank you, is going to show you up more in local service ads when you're willing to pay more money at the bottom line. Jacob's gotten over 300 and I think it was close to 350 or it was 300 plus qualified leads, meaning these are people that call about cases that he specifically identified as cases that he wants to take. And if somebody does not call about one of those cases, then you don't have to pay for the lead. So that's really great because first of all, you're just getting phone calls. I mean, that's really what you want. You want your phone yeah. to ring. And that's, that's why we're so focused on local service ads and generating phone calls for our clients. And also you can get messages as well. So it's not just about phone calls. It's about also getting messages that your team can respond to within the local service ad dashboard. So for you guys that don't know what local service ads are, you can run these ads if you are any type of an attorney or any type of realtor, including property managers, or any type of service area business. And there's a list of them, including plumbers, electricians, et cetera. But this was just opened up. This is what Google My Business was like eight years ago. It was like a gold rush. That's why I say it's a race to the starting line because what Jacob's done, and one of the reasons why he's showing up almost every time it, for immigration attorney San Diego. Oh, you're number one. There you go. Good. Okay. <laughs> Number one, here's what's really cool. So look at how many reviews that Jacob's got. He's got 265. His reviews moved from his Google My Business page. They moved him over from his GMB page, which he's probably down here as well. But here, no, see, this is, this is your Google My Business pages. This is, by the way, the reason why Google created local service ads is because Peter Chu is stuffing the heck out of his title and that is the reason why he's showing up as number one. He is cheating and we can report him for spam and we can get him removed. Right. So this is, this is why- and You should, right? Yes, and we can. And we, this is part of one of, the, this is one of the services that we offer is we can actually remove these specific businesses from, the, <clears throat> from Google My Business because this is like, look at Immigration Attorney San Diego, really? Like that is not his real business name. Just know that if you do that kind of stuff, you run the risk of also actually being removed like completely from Google My Business. But here's the thing is 260 reviews. So that means what's the difference there? So you have 260 down here on Google My Business and you have, how many did you have? 265 for your Google My Business or for your local service ad page. The difference is, is the number of reviews that you've gotten in your local service ad page. And one of the things I'm gonna to suggest to you, Jacob, and one of the things that we really need to work with your team on is getting what are called verified jobs. This one right here, you've only gotten one, but what we need to do is, is we really need to get you more of these verified reviews because what we've seen is there is, there's a very tight correlation with verified reviews and your rankings in the local service ad section specifically. So what we would suggest, Jacob, because you do have people that come into your office, if they come through local service ads, is have them specifically go on their phone and do the same thing that I'm showing you right here and click on this button that's on your local service ad page in order to leave you guys a review so that it is actually verified. Because Google's actually listening to all phone calls that come in from local service ads, they, they know who's coming in to your your local service ad page, and they can verify that that person is a real person. That's why they call it a verified. What other topic do you do is you it want? is it possible though to do it? You think to what set up additional local service ad pages? Oh mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah, hundred percent. All I need is some kind of an address, right? 
I'll answer it in the video. Okay. Record. All right.